Hey guys, MM here. We're gonna talk about Gothic architecture today. When someone says Gothic, we first think about those Goths, ghosts, and other scary things lurking in the dark. It's not that. The idea of Gothic style was thought of to bring sunshine into people's lives, especially in their churches. The Gothic style of architecture originated from the 12th century France to the 16th century where the modern square symbol was thought of and created. The characteristics of the Gothical architectural style were pointed arches, flying buttresses, tall spires, ribbed vaults, stained glass, and of course, the gargoyles. The characteristics that distinguishes Gothical architecture from the others are mainly the pointed arches, flying buttresses, and the ribbed vaults. And as you can see in the video, those three characteristics are the ones I shaded red. Back in the old days, building skills were extremely limited. Most buildings were rudimentary. Thus, Gothic architecture was brought up to brighten up the buildings. In comparison with Romanesque style, Romanesque had barrel vaults, while Gothic had rib vaults. It focused on large internal structures, while Gothic was more into high buildings. Romanesque had thick walls to support the structure, while Gothic had flying buttresses. And of course, Romanesque grew into round arches, as the latter was into pointed ones. Examples of Gothical buildings is the Basilica of St. Denis in Paris, France, the first structure built in Gothical style, Notre Dame de Paris, the most famous of all Gothical buildings, thanks to the novel, the Salisbury Cathedral in England is a fine example of the English Gothical architecture, and of course Hogwarts was also designed in a Gothical way. Now that you know the basics of Gothic architecture, don't be afraid to discuss this topic with your friends and share your ideas so you guys can learn more. So this is the end of the video. Thank you for watching and goodbye!